Welcome back everyone to the first ever Five Tip Friday. Today's tip, I'm gonna be showing you how to fix your clipped audio in Adobe Premiere using Adobe Edition. When I filmed the What's in My Camera Bag 2018 video, I had used my girlfriend's camera and some random old mic I had laying around to film it. For some reason, I don't know why, I never checked the audio levels on the camera first before recording. So it was all clipped and it sounded terrible. And now here we are. All right, let's jump on in. First, you wanna make sure you have Adobe Edition installed before you open up Premiere, just to make things that much easier. This is what the audio sounded like. Not good at all. What you're gonna do is right click on the clip, the clip that you wanna edit the audio on in the timeline. Click edit in Adobe Audition. Now it's gonna take a while for it to open and everything like that. Make sure that it is installed before getting to this point, otherwise I won't let you click that option. Now it's open in Edition. Um, so you're gonna to go to the Diagnostics tabs here. If you don't have it there, you're gonna go up to the window and click it there, and then it'll be down here. So under Effect, you wanna make sure you have Declipper selected. Then under Preset, you wanna to go to Restore Heavily Clipped. Then you're gonna open up Settings here. You're gonna to wanna to adjust the tolerance up a bit. I usually do between nine and 10%. Um, we'll just do 9% on this one. Then you click scan. Now it just pulls up every single clip here that where the point where the audio clipped, which is obviously basically the whole thing. So now you're gonna click repair all. And just wait a minute, it takes a little bit. And then now you should be able to test the audio and it'll sound much better. Now it's not perfect and you can do a lot more in this program to adjust a lot more things to try to make it sound even better, um, but there's just a quick way to try and get it sounding at least savable. It's obviously best to get the best audio when you're recording instead of trying to fix it in post. Um, so now from this window in here, you're just going to save it, just Command S, and then you can go back to Premiere and you'll see that it actually replaced the clip here right in Premiere. And then you can go about mixing it like you normally would. Hope you guys liked my first tutorial and the first ever 5 Tip Friday. Get subscribed for weekly content. Let me know what kind of tutorials you would like to see next. Uh, hit the like button if this helped you at all. Uh, see you guys in the next one.